Hi guys, today we will discuss about databases for ligand selection. So there are number of databases, but first we will go through PubChem, ChemSpider and Zinc15. PubChem, here you can draw the structure as well as the structure you can get it from there. So here the structures which are available are already uh, approved. Only those structures will be available in PubChem. Whereas you go to ChemSpider, in ChemSpider you can get the same structure whichever you get from PubChem but here you can get both in uh, 2D format as well as 3D format and you can download in the format of mole. In Zing 15 you get the structures where you can purchase as well as you can download freely. Whereas uh, we come to PubChem. In PubChem, let us go and uh, search for an example. See, you can see the examples there are there. Let's search for aspirin itself. So this is the structure of aspirin. So here you will get a detailed information about the structure. You will have physiochemical properties. You will have toxicity properties as well as you will have the purchasing options chemical vendors and you will have the safety and hazards toxicity and you will have IUPAC names you will have uh, other for, uh, names like uh, smiles and in see you can see in kai uh, that is INCHI um, INCHI is also a type of naming of the compounds canonical smiles are there, molecular formula is there, molecular weight will be there and so many. So you can see here there are three different structures that is 2D, 3D as well as crystal structure. So we need a 3D structure for molecular docking. So we can download from here in the format of SDF. So the download will be in the form of SDF and you can open it and see. Whereas we come to ChemSpider, ChemSpider as I told there will be a number of uh, molecules you can search by using name, you can search by using smiles, you can search by inchi name or CSID name. So there are many other names or synonyms and all the derivatives will be available in ChemSpider. Let's go and search for aspirin itself. So you can see the molecular formula average mass that is mass of the molecule then <coughs> chem spider id number and there are other properties see you can uh, see the names properties searches spectra vendors articles and others more that is like what are the links of those images and those things you can get from here so there are various names for aspirin so you can see here you can download if you click on this 3d the 3d structure will be seen then you can save it so you will get in the format of mole whereas in zinc 15 you can go to the substances you can draw the structure, you can give the smiles, you can give zinc ID or you can give that inch I names or you can upload a file. So let's go and uh, draw a benzene along with some bonds. Let's see if uh, there will be different derivatives we can get from here. Sorry. Yeah. Let's see for this one. You can go for analogs also, uh, but it is a slow process. It takes time for getting those analogs and search many. If you give, you'll get the compounds which are almost similar. As uh, the structure is not proper, maybe it is uh, not coming. So let's search for a known compound. Let's go for aspirin itself. I'll take the smiles from here.
okay so this is the canonical smiles i'll paste it here let me search this one see you can see this one this is the structure of aspirin and you can download this one here it has zinc id as zinc 53 so this uh, this is the download option so you can download in all this format miles sgf csv xml and js one but mainly we'll go to sgf format itself okay fine these are the uh, methods or databases from where you can download the ligands for molecular docking thank you